Hey guys, it's Mike, your dietitian at the Weight Loss Institute of Arizona. I'm gonna show you how to make a quick lunch today. We're gonna use cucumbers as our bread replacement, basically making a cucumber sandwich. So what I have right here, of course, is my cucumber. I'm gonna slice that pretty thin. And you, what you can do is you can just slice the whole cucumber up and you can make your sandwiches here first, get the cucumber out of the way when you're done. And you can do a lot of things with this, but what I like to do is I like to use smoked salmon as my as my protein when I'm making these. So you're just gonna start with any, any smoked salmon you wanna buy. I got mine at Sprouts. Um, put whatever portion you want on there. So you're gonna place that on there. So we're gonna start with some hummus to, to spread on the bottom. You don't need a lot, just a little bit. Just like you're making a sandwich, you're gonna put a little bit of hummus on the bottom there. This is uh, avocado hummus. And on the top, I'm gonna put a little bit of Greek yogurt dip, and this is a cucumber dill. It really goes really good with the salmon. So there we go. So we got our both sides of that, and then we're gonna add our salmon on either side we want. A little bit of cheese, whatever kind you like, on top of that. And then we're gonna spread a little bit of green onion on top, right there. Okay, so it looks like an hors d'oeuvre. We're gonna close it up, but before we do that, let's squeeze, squeeze a little lemon juice on there. We're gonna close that and make our little sandwich. A little messy, but that's okay. So there you have it. So a cucumber sandwich. Do a lot of things with this. You can use deli meat instead of the salmon, that's fine. And different types of spreads if you want. But this is gonna be obviously low calorie. I would say if you have weight loss surgery, you might be able to eat three of these at the most at one sitting. You're talking low calorie, but good protein. Um, and most importantly, they'll fill you up. So share on Facebook and let us know what you think. Um, if you have a new recipe you come up with, uh, we'd love to hear about it.